always running around the coast trying to find some great little places for you to go shop at. Well, I found one in Gulfport, kind of hidden away behind the old Gulfport East Hancock Bank. It's on 14th Avenue. It's called the Vintage Flamingo. And, oh, boy, do they have some cool stuff. Now, Sharon Landner is one of the owners here at Vintage Flamingo. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Tell, you, tell us where you and your partners came up with this idea. This is awesome. <laughs> well, actually, we had visited stores like this around the country, and we thought this would be something good to bring to the Gulf Coast. Okay. Good. Well, I mean, you've got, the items are unbelievable, and we're going to really take a quick tour because you've got a lot of room here to, to, uh, to cover. We have 30 vendors total, and each vendor brings something very unique. Now this one here, this is uh, the old vault that used to be here. I mentioned that this is located, your building is located behind the old northeast branch of Hancock, uh, or uh, yeah, east branch of uh, Hancock Bank in Gulfport. But uh, this was an old vault that they had. Here. Yeah, we bought the building actually from Hancock Bank, and I uh, really liked the vault, so we decided to keep the vault. Now, we want to mention to you, too, that uh, you're only open a couple of times uh, weekends a month during the holidays, which is October, November, December. Uh, during the rest of the year, you're only open one weekend a month. Yes, we're open the second Thursday through Sunday of the month. But you will and that's every weekend. Every weekend. So, uh, but this coming weekend, you will be open, and then you won't be open again until November. So you might want to come in and check out some of the great stuff that you have here. And... Where do they come up with some of these things? I mean, we've got antiques here, paintings. One of my business partners takes trips to Texas, and uh, she brings a lot of her merchandise back from Texas, antique furniture mm -hmm. and finds. And then I uh, bring stuff from Savannah. And, um, a beautiful dining room set. And a lot of home, uh, uh, handmade pieces, too. Yes, we have some talented, talented vendors. Look at all these great items. Um, one of a kind pieces uh, show up to market all the time. Uh, this is actually a piece that was in um, the federal office building. Really? Mm -hmm. So this is pretty. It's got a stamp on the bottom that says from the federal office. Pieces. So it was used in, I guess, some postal service. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, you can see here, this is a, a huge huge place with all the different stuff. There's some big candlesticks. Oh, the old, some old camera equipment in there. And where, where's, a, you know, where's a lot of this? You, know, you mentioned some of it you get from Savannah and your part of it. The, the, the different um, uh, vendors. Tell me, tell me about some of the vendors that you have here. Most of our vendors are local vendors. We have a, um, a pair of sisters here. Mm -hmm. um, one is from the coast. One is moving very quickly to the coast. <laughs> and um, let's see. Uh, mm -hmm. This vendor here is from Kentucky, and they take trips to Kentucky uh, to bring merchandise here to market. Wow. This vendor here coming up next is a husband and wife team that they build all of this furniture. Really? And they are in their 70s. Yeah. This, is, this was their retirement dream. And they build all this? They build all of this. Wow. Very talented. And then, of course, you've got more stuff down you know, all over here. Yes, some furniture. vendors in the back. Mm -hmm. And um, this is a father-daughter team. She's the painter. He builds all the furniture. Wow. He builds the stuff and she paints it. Correct, correct. That is really cool. I know this china cabinet here came from Orange Beach, mm -hmm. Alabama. A lot of beautiful glass work inside. Mm -hmm. We have a lot of mid-century modern pieces show up. This is one right here. Uh, this is a very talented fabric artist. Mm -hmm. And uh, she makes pillows and all kinds of stools and chairs with her fabric that she brings to the coast. Mm -hmm. This is our ultimate gentleman's booth right here. Any restoration hardware you need, you'll find right here. Right. Oh, that is cool. Old school desks. Um, those shutters are from uh, New Orleans. Look at the old bench. <laughs> Isn't that nice? Oh, that actually old chair it looked like it came out of a church or something. This booth has a coastal flair. Mm -hmm. Variety of coastal needs with, a, of course, a farm table stuck in there. 
a lot of great antiques in here. Anybody that's you know really into collecting antique pieces, you're going to find a lot of great stuff in here. Yeah, I'm, I mean, move it over to this side. I mean, look at here. Here's a, here's a coat rack, coat tree. This is a true one of a kind right here in this armoire. This gentleman does uh, car restoration, and he uh, works coastally here, and he does this as a hobby and brings in uh, pieces to our market. He also he he uh, does benches out of car parts. Mm -hmm. Very very eclectic. Typewriters. This this is just came in the market yesterday. It's beautiful. We also sell chalk paint. Two different types of chalk paint. Uh, Paint powder. Mm-hmm. Dixie Bell, we have McLean's chalk paint and Webster's chalk powder. So if you need chalk paint for your restoration piece, you can get it right here. They use that a lot? Mm -hmm. Restoration pieces? They do. Instead of just regular paint. Right. It's it adheres to the uh, wood better than regular really? paint, yes. Oh. And it's uh, no primer needed. Really? Oh, well, that's a big step saver. See a lot more pieces here, some pieces of jewelry. We have everything and anything you'll need for your holiday shopping. I would think so. I would definitely think so. And we're going to remind you again that you're um, normally open only one weekend a month. This is the second Thursday through Sunday of every month. Okay, except for October, November, December, when you will actually be open two weekends a month. Matter of fact, as far as October, this weekend coming up is it for October, and then uh, you've got a couple of weekends in November, yes, and uh, a couple of weekends in, in uh, December as well. November, we're definitely going to do a small business uh, Saturday, and we'll be open for Black Friday, and then um, we'll do a market closer to Christmas, which will probably be the 23rd and 24th. Now, what hours will you be open, Sharon? We're usually open at 9 o'clock every day, and we stay open until 6 p.m. every night. Okay. And you Friday kind of, night we have a little bit of a late night and we stay open until 7. Oh, there you go. Bring some wine and just kind of sit back and relax. we got to uh, cater to our casino workers. Oh, that's awesome. That is wonderful. So, again, you know, if you're looking for the place, remember the old Gulfport East branch of Hancock Bank. It's closed now, but it's located right behind it on 14th Avenue. You cannot miss it because uh, you'll see this huge pink flamingo on the, <laughs> on the side of the building, which is absolutely beautiful. But, uh, you know, come check it out. Check out some of the great stuff. I love these doors here. I wish I had some place to put them. Those are nice. Those are really, really nice. But as you can see, they've got all kinds of great stuff here. It's the pink flamingo. They're going to be open this weekend, so come check them out. Oh, the vintage flamingo. Are you ready?